My favorite thing about science is certainly the moment of discovery. So that, that moment when you find something, you know, the answer to your question, and you know that nobody else knows it. You know, at that moment is something that's just completely yours, that you came up with and you um, created. And that is, there's no other feeling um, that comes even close. Then you immediately see, you know, it's like, it's like opening a door and you walk in the room and there are more doors and there are more doors and you immediately see that you can just, you know, keep carrying on with coming up with more questions and, and it doesn't, you know, it doesn't end. Is that discovery is beautiful and it carries on and then it's like well what's next and what's next and that is there's nothing more exciting than that I mean I go to bed thinking about it I get up I'm thinking about it because it's, it's just really becomes um, a huge part of how you have you think about your work and how you live your life every day My name is uh, Patty Brennan, and I um, am a research assistant professor at UMass. I actually went to an all-girls Catholic school um, in Colombia, and we um, we got a lot of instruction on typing and uh, shorthand and accounting, and uh, you know things that that uh, probably uh, they really felt were more appropriate for girls to do <laughs> that were not necessarily science. Um, but when I got to college, uh, really, I think uh, my, the first subject matter that I really fell in love with was physiology. And uh, I was particularly fascinated by diving physiology. And my physiology teacher was a, was a woman, and she was really, really tough. She was very, very stern. Um, but I really liked the subject matter, and so I studied um, quite hard and she was very encouraging even even as she was uh, you know I recognized in her toughness she was really just trying to see how much I could really do. Um, I'm an evolutionary biologist and a behavioral ecologist so my PhD um, was in neurobiology and behavior from Cornell. Uh, originally I'm a marine biologist which is what I studied when I was down in Colombia and uh, when I became a postdoc I became more interested in, in evolutionary biology. So I guess it's, it's, you know, I'm a bit of a hybrid of, of different fields. There's, there are always gonna be people who are gonna criticize what you do, no matter what it is. And there are always people who are gonna think you're getting something, not because of the hard work you're doing, but because you know, the way you look or who you are or who you know or who knows what. The only thing I can say is I have worked hard all my life and now those people who, you know, used to make up stories or, or not, you know, really be particularly encouraging or whatever, well, I've proved them all wrong. So what, what better thing than that? It's just, you just have to be who you are. If you love what you're doing, you're doing the right thing. So keep doing it and just don't listen to anybody who would tell you otherwise. Just work hard and, and should prove them all wrong. That's, that's really the best revenge. <laughs>